Hi, I'm Anthony Hughes, and in this video I'm going to show you how to enter chords using Dorico, the new music notation software from Steinberg. Now, usually in note input, the carrot advances as soon as you have entered a note. In Dorico, switching on the chords button here in the notes toolbox, or pressing the key command Q, prevents the carrot from auto advancing. And so, as you add more notes, they effectively stack up on top of each other to make a chord. Space always advances the carrot by the selected note duration in the notes panel, so this works as a way to move on and create another chord. When you have no further chords to input, simply click the chords button again, or press Q, and the carrot will immediately begin to auto advance again. A further little trick with this is that you can change the note duration while chord mode is on as a way to input some more complicated notations. By default, notes are always added above existing notes in the chord. However, you can specify a note in a lower octave by holding down Ctrl and Alt on Windows while you type the note name. That's just control on Mac. You can also use a MIDI keyboard to enter your notes and specify the intended octave directly. I hope this has been helpful to you. Please subscribe to our channel to see more videos like this. I'm Anthony Hughes. Thanks for watching.